Well, hi, y'all. It's another Saturday night, and I ain't got no well, I got a little money. But I was too tired. I said, nah, I ain't going to go out. And it was threatening to rain, and it was like, me. You know, I'm check, this is, check this came in. I haven't spent anything but, but the rent and a couple of bills. Um, I have a big sack of weed and plenty of <laughs> tobacco. I don't need any money for that for tomorrow. You know? I need to have about 20 bucks for some shipping on Monday morning. Um, my, I, it's, it's pretty hectic at, at Facebook right now um, with some of my transgender friends. <laughs> Lexi Cans got it into it with, uh, I, I still don't have much of the detail. We only have the one, the, 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 the person's um, Parting, parting shot. That's all we, all we see. I'm, I'm waiting on Lexi. Well, let's see what Mike Birch. Oh, this guy. This is a This is a libertard. Uh, definitely a PKF sufferer. Let's see what's going on here. I, I, I blew him up uh, about an hour ago, at least. Oh, the camera's on. I forgot. <laughs> oh boy. Here, here, here's here's the exchange. Um, here's the here's, here's the OP. Oh no, it's just one of these long ones. The Hillary witch hunt is irrational and disgusting. It boils down to a few nonsensical principles. Number one, when getting positive things done, Hillary is weak and completely incompetent. Two, when anything bad happens anywhere in the world, Hillary is all-powerful, able to start wars and destroy nations. Three, Hillary is judged by a different measure than other politicians. The State Department has been lax in security, but no one has accused other secretaries of state of being treasonous criminals. Only Hillary is a traitor, a spy, a criminal, a monster. Four, turning Hillary into a caricature, a cartoon, then attack a cartoon with incredible gusto and venom. It's okay to prod them out because Hillary is a witch and a monster, except that she isn't. I don't know. A woman's got a serious temper. <laughs> she puts some, she, she put some deep scratches into, into Billy Boy's face when he was in the White House. <laughs> right in front of the Secret Service and a Japanese delegation, she went nuts on him. She scratched up his face. Uh, we don't accuse, yeah, this is just, hey man, you know, this is like, this is just like suppositions and, 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 and just nonsense. You know, where's the facts? What are your facts, Jack? 
you know, we don't accuse Lincoln of wanting genocide in the South. We don't call JFK. You know, where are your facts? This is all straw men and red herrings. This is Robert Jaslowski gets on him about that all the time. And, and you know, he's never quite this stupid. Uh, in my recollection, he just he just suddenly became stupid in the last six months or so. Let's see what Jay Richardson had to say to him. <laughs> Jay's usually cool. We wouldn't have had an ISIS in Iraq if Hillary and her co-conspirators hadn't wanted to show unity with George W. Bush's unnecessary unlawful war of aggression against Iraq. Well, you know, Hillary and Bill Clinton are part of the Bushwhackers. But George W. Bush has been the de facto president of this country since John Kennedy got whacked. He was there. But you look, go, go, go look at YouTube. He's, he's, a, he's almost half admitted to it a couple of times. Um... Uh, and, and here Mike is going to get into a long, long-winded argument with him. Yeah, blah blah blah. Oh, and Vicky Nancer is in there. She's she's really good. You seem to be drunk on intense hatred for people who think differently than you do, calling them monsters. Vicky's a Vicky's like pretty nasty. <laughs> uh, I had to block her finally. Uh, I couldn't take it anymore. She's just too nasty. But this Mike is just block. You know, this is a bit, uh, what do they call it? Verbose. Just blah, 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 blah. No back for back, nothing off. Just opinions. Oh, and Greta Berlin's in there. She's got me blocked. Vicky, I've got Vicky blocked, and Greta's got me blocked. <laughs> Greta, go look that one up. If you don't know Greta, Greta Berlin, she's, she's a piece of work. <laughs> okay, so here, now there's been some reports, and this isn't witch hunting or anything. This is people who are saying, hey, look, something's wrong with Hillary. Um, There's a bunch of it. Um, and I'm going to get into it later. You know, I'm going to go. I'm going to run it down uh, when when I finish with the transgender. Uh, uh, I wouldn't want to call it a crisis. <laughs> Interpersonal disagreement. <laughs> That's the winner. Wait till you wait till you guys see this one. <laughs> but here's for starters. Here, this is you know. Excuse me. Uh, uh, you know, give me some feedback. Am I am I being like? Wrong-headed about all this. I mean, this is Dunning. This is L-type. You know, this is Libertard. This is Libertard City from this guy. And I just finally just lost, you know, just lost patience. I'm out of it. Okay, have you looked into the facts of Hillary's health? I didn't say anything. Or like her brain. Um, response from him. Have you? I have read. And here's here's his here's, here's his. I have read several articles by psychiatrists who have questioned Trump's mental health. I haven't heard any reports that Hillary has brain problems. Wasn't there something that she got hospitalized for a couple of years ago? By all accounts, she seems to be highly intelligent, highly competent. Of course, the witch hunters think otherwise, but witch hunts are irrational affairs. <laughs> no, this is about her physical health. I just saw something flash by and was wondering if you knew anything about it. There have been a couple of videos where she had some strange little fits. And I just saw something go by that said something about mini strokes, degenerative and degenerative brain disease getting hushed up. I think it was on Bobby Schiff's wall. I'm busy with something else, or I jumped on it already. And here's just more, more blah blah. There have been the usual wild allegations by right wing propagandists. Hillary's bathroom break uh, debate was not really a bathroom break, but some sort of stroke, etc. If there were any real evidence, of course, the major news services would be all over it. Well. <laughs> if they don't want to tell you about something, they won't. That's just the way that shit works. If you think otherwise, forget it. Don't even talk to me. You're just like PKS, <laughs> DKS, man. You got Dunning Dunning Kruger syndrome. Just don't don't like you know. That was uh, in, in in my generation. My uh, uh, Eric Hopper wrote his True Believer, and that's what this guy is. His True Believer. You know, it's like as in Hopper Hopper did a. a and this is all off the top of his head, too, on uh, the uh, psychology of political movements. It's become a you know a little tiny book, but it's it's a, it's a uh, and the guy was a longshoreman too. So anyway, here here's I view to blah blah blah. How how about I'm busy with something right else right else right now. Right behind it. How about you do something constructive to work on this breaking story rather than all that jibber jabber on witch hunters. And, 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 you know, I just, Hillary Clinton health. 
So I put it in there, bam, and, and all this shit come out. And it's a hot button item right now, and it's on a lot of different news services. I didn't check and see if it was the majors, but so what? If the majors don't want to talk about it, they aren't gonna. If there's a blackout on it, it's gonna be blacked out. That's the way they work. If you don't believe what I'm saying, take that shit, go, go take it to your little, you know, your little, um, you know, extremist group, or whatever it is. But excuse me, um, I've been part of the resistance for a long, long time. Um, and this is what's, you know, I, 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 I dumpstered. They're protocols. So they're, they're, they, I, I, got the, I got the computer game results out of Peter Norton's garbage can on how they were going to play this war on terrorism. Got it out of, like, in 1985, took it out of Peter Norton's garbage can. Got their whole plan for this war on terrorism. Know exactly what's going on. There's something they don't want you to know about. They aren't going to let it into any of the major news services. So anyway, if there was a serious problem, you know, this is this is this guy. Yeah, he's a true believer. This is a total true believer. I mean, like, never mind. If there is a serious problem, why haven't any of the major news services mentioned it? Why is it just lunatic friends? Well, that's why it's just lunatic friends because the major news services are trying to suppress it. Hillary Clinton, with a temporary neurological dysfunction, would still be worlds better than Trump on his best day, in my opinion. Well, opinions are like assholes, pal. And you're a stink. If a major news service reports a serious problem, I will be all ears. <laughs> There's that major news service again. But to me, it sounds like the witch hunters doing their thing. Uh-huh. Have you ever heard of the Dunning-Kruger effect? Your response to me is idiotic. Have you been made stupid by something? Go run the fuck down and answer those questions yourself. <laughs> Calling someone idiotic is what idiots do. No. Um, I didn't call him idiotic. I called his response idiotic. There's a difference there. He just called me an idiot. <laughs> I'm not stupid. And I don't appreciate your boorish. No, you didn't get no boorish insults. You got a classy insult, dude. <laughs> You're getting boorish insults here, fuck stain. <laughs> and don't tell me what to do. Run down the questions yourself. And if you can't behave like a civilized person, I will block you. <laughs> I'm like going neoliberal fascist on me now, Mike. Do what you will. I shared this thread into the DKS Awareness Network. I have no time for people suffering from chronic cognitive bias. Have a nice night, Mike. Uh, and then it, it was, you know, then I quoted him. Uh, you know, if a major news service reports a serious problem, I will be all ears. And my response to that was, there's a reason. It's called programming, Mike. Um, so every major news service is suppressing news about the Hillary's brain problems, but they don't suppress all the other allegations. Yes, that makes more sense. Well, if you if you had any kind of reasonable understanding of what the fuck was going on in the, in the military industrial complex way of doing things, um, instead of like just sucking down all that blue Kool-Aid. Uh, I'm tired of your insults. Go bother someone else. I am blocking you. Well, that's, 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 that's okay. Now he's blocking me, so I, my comeback. <laughs> Mike Burrell, I'll do it, yeah. You know, do, I, do I look like I give a fuck? You're adult, dude. Fucking poster child for L-type Dunning-Kruger syndrome. Your cognitive reasoning, uh, reasoning ability has been short-circuited by self-delusions resulting from mental conditioning by the major news services. Block me, fool. This thread is going to live in perpetuity. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Okay, who else? Olita is talking to Bodhi. Isn't that a good shot? Yes. Yeah, 
has a zero. It looks kind of really has a zero. This is where his Hemingway look. Why wow, it, it Bodhisattva is one of the old 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 school Rainbow Brothers. This good friend um, that just posted a really cool, nice, nice black and white uh, photo. Uh, it's got kind of an Ernest Hemingway look. Belief is funny. She's she's a she's a rainbow grandma, great grandma. She's a great grandmother. She drives a yellow Volkswagen. She's so funny. She's wild. And she lives out here in the desert somewhere. What else is going on? Okay, that's that's that. That's that's the uh, okay, Kelly and yeah. Um, fuck you, Mike. That's <laughs> just stupid. Roxanne, I already saw that. Okay, there's someone posted. There's people that commented on a post that may not have answered. Oh, this is this is too. This one's too much. Yeah, bubble. You don't. This uh, this one is too much. Um, I forget whose wallet was on. Uh, but but uh, someone's comment. You know, it's an Islamic phobic meme of some kind and, and uh, this one guy this one guy says fuck all Muslims and my comeback to him was that's a hell of a lot of Muslim fucking you want to do there cowboy there's 1.7 billion of them worldwide how do you plan to fuck them all and and and, and I brought it I brought it to the folks and tagged a bunch of my uh, okay AZ, AZ's out of there she didn't want to be any part of that um, <laughs> and uh, so anyway, uh, Mo, Mo Jaredot, uh is Palestinian, um, real sweetheart, young young lady. Her, she said, I, I'm not surprised at all when I read shit like that from sick individuals like Godfrey who wants to start a World War III. There are many individual ignorant haters around the world like Godfrey. Who's Godfrey? Is that the guy that, oh yeah, Godfrey. Yeah, Dean Godfrey. Uh, he's nothing but a mouthpiece to Zionist control media playing his role in spreading hatred and a lot of Islamophobia. What else is going on? Fuck you, Mike. <laughs> just keep, just keep, just keep whining, man. We're done. I'm done with you. Are you know? <laughs> it's just your shit's too long to read. <laughs> it's, 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 it's boring and redundant. And fuck you, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, I guess there's nothing else going on here. Let's see what the idiots are doing. He sent it. He sent it weeks ago.
Hey, here's uh, where's this Jimmy? Uh, <coughs> boy, I gotta do something about these. Here's Jimmy, Jimmy Webster in his latest round. Tommy's just a toothless bald man in a wig and dress. And if that is saying, I don't know what to tell you. He has a letter from a doctor that doesn't say he's mentally ill, so obviously it means he's not. I guess he's a letter from my doctor, blah, 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 blah. <coughs> oh, blah, blah, blah. It's just a bunch of fucking idiots. It's total waste of time with you boys. I'm going to sue, or I'm going to find a way to get you guys hurt. You know, I don't give a shit at this point. What kind of queer is Tommy? He's a big, fat, balding, two this queer, wears a wig, dress. I hardly ever wear a wig, or I, I never wear a dress. Sometimes skirts. Come on, let's see what is this is this some new shit that he's ripped off? No, it's ripped off my really fuck this, I'm out of here. It's just it's just much too distressing. It's garbage. Oh shit, I missed that. Son of a bitch. Let's see what it sold for. Ten dollars. I would have paid that. Bummer. Bummer, bummer, bummer. I was gonna spear that. Got all fucking wrapped up in other shit. There was a a uh, 44 gram chunk of Slaughter Mountain Fire Agate that yeah, sold for ten dollars, twelve dollars and sixty cents delivered. Shh, too bad. Let's see what else they got this well, That one might be worth doing. There's a 26 gram piece, Slaughter Mountain. Oh yeah, let's keep an eye on that one. Let's see what's up with that one. Looks like somebody worked that one over pretty good, all badly. <laughs> yep. Yep, sure did, and then gave up on it because they fucked it up. <laughs> no thanks. Let's see what else we got here. This one too. Uh, these have just been fucking uh, wanked on. Fire is real tough to cut because it's all over the place. It's all you know. It's a picture rock soup, and and just stuff you know. It's molten and all this. Then 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 it, then it hardens. Yeah. Nah. I don't think I want these fire agates, these, this, 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 uh, slaughter mountain pieces that they fucked up. No, 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 thanks. What else? Anything else? I'm tired. One person wants to join the group. Who else? I thought I'd let you in. I thought I, I thought I'd, uh, you know, I, I'm, I, I, it's, it's time for me to go to bed. <laughs> I think it's time for me to go to bed. Let's see what's up with Lottie Dodd and Friends' estate sale. Lottie's uh, got all sorts of goodies as usual. Let's see also Diane, I remember her. This is the Chicago crowd. Lottie Dawes having a big estate sale this weekend. The Jewish geisha girl. <laughs> She's something else. I, I have such wonderful friends. No, none of them are real close, but there's just so many of them, and they're so they're so dynamic. So everybody's different. Everybody's got their own thing, and you know, a lot of a lot of self-published authors and poets and stuff, and all kinds of musicians and. Graphic artists and educators and tradespeople and you know cats like Dane and I mean he doesn't like you know I think he's got a problem with transgender I think I kind of repel him a bit 
um, a little too different for him. Because um, he's like he's like a master carpenter. He's a nice fellow, you know, older guy, just into the dead and the dead music and the dead type scene. Um, which is, you know, that's, so it's not no some emotion. You know, it's a, it's such a happy time for everybody. No, you know, there's no drama ever. I don't think I've ever heard any of those people raise their voices at each other there, ever. Um, this is plenty long. I'm 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 tired. I'm gonna go to sleep. I'm gonna upload this and go to sleep. I forgot what I did it about. <laughs> Happy day. Bye.